March afternoon in Cleveland. Home of the Cavaliers, where this afternoon two of the NBA special players will be on display. Kobe Bryant and LeBron James and their teams going at it. A sellout crowd expected here this afternoon in an important game for both two as we continue to go towards the playoffs. Kobe Bryant and LeBron James don't see each other or talk to each other very often, but you can tell that they have a mutual respect for each other. About Kobe Bryant, LeBron James said simply he's the best player in our game. People are always trying to compare us. And we have totally different games. He said that Kobe Bryant also has more of a killer instinct than he does because Kobe has been in the championships. He says, I have it. Now about LeBron James, Kobe Bryant said people get lost in his talent and athleticism. But what I like about him is he has an incredible understanding Cook throws up the air ball, much to the delight of the crowd, and Flip Murray can't get it to go. Of course, Murray, one of the newest members of the Cavs, they push it up now to L.A., and Swish Parker able to put it in. Yeah, you cannot fall asleep with the Lakers this year with Swish Parker out there. He'll release early, and with he and Kobe Bryant, they can run a two-man break. Tommy Brown guarding Ogaskis. Brown has actually done some good things defensively recently. Does a good job that time. I, I like the strategy. They're going right at Kwame Brown. And Parker once again in the open floor. Now this is an Achilles heel this year of Cleveland. They do not get back. Mike Brown, the first year head coach for the Cavs. He's a defensive guy as James tries to get it inside. Nice pass and good with the strong finish. Uh, Brown has been trying to get this Cavalier team to play with the same intensity on the defensive end as they do at the other end of the floor. Uh, another nice pass. James feeding beautifully to Ogowskis. Yeah, you can see that right there. They're the remaining games. Naturally, there'll be a lot of pressure on them. They must win them because we know that Sacramento is hot right now in the seventh position, a game ahead of the Lakers. But then also you have Utah creeping up. Can Utah sustain it? Brown, of course, the former number one pick with Washington has had his ups and downs in his career. He's done some decent things defensively, as we said, as Bryant drills another one. But he has been very inconsistent on the offensive end. It's the second meeting of the season between the two. They played in L.A. back on January 12th. Lakers won by a point as Kobe Bryant got hot late in the game. Ogowska said his best game scoring-wise of the season against him, and he's got two there. Well, any time that Kwame Brown or Cook pick Ogowska up in the post, you've got to go down inside. When you look at Murray, Mike, the way to look at it is the guy's playing 39 minutes a game. That's incredible. Parker again, Swiss Parker. Now four for four, and he's got ten points already. Marshall, nice. Lost it. And Bryant releases down the other end, and a foul. Eric Snow mad at himself as Bryant with a chance for a three-point play. Now think about it. That's your third layup in this quarter on a one-man fast break. Odom fires away and knocks down the three. Lamar Odom's been shooting beautifully recently, and it's an 8-0 run by the Lakers. They're up by 13. James trying to get himself going, and there it is, his first field goal, and he does it with under a minute remaining in the period. Well, I think Lamar Odom said something to him because that was a very difficult shot. Lamar's done an excellent job on LeBron. Now, remember now, Odom is at 6'9 with long arms. That's not an easy shot either with a guy right on you, and he makes it look easy. Kobe Bryant now, four of six from the field. James oh, forces up. Oh, he puts him oh, the three-pointer. <laughs> You cannot play him any tougher than that. What a shot. I was ready to say that's a bad shot from James. <laughs> and he nails it. So back-to-back -back buckets for James. Back-to-back -back buckets for Brian. But you always have to go back to the fact LeBron James is only in his third year. We kind of want to miss that point. Kobe is in his 10th season. So naturally, he's been put into many difficult pressurized situations. Well, James hitting a lot of difficult shots. As an assistant, I had the opportunity to be around Kareem, and he was absolutely outstanding. He uh, won the MVP four times in, you know, like his first five years in the league. That's not bad. <laughs> no, I, I would think so. But uh, the thing that I was always amazed at is how hard he worked on his pivot game, especially in the exhibition 30 days. Course, again, the Larry Hughes injury is so important in terms of what they had hoped for this year, and they still hope he's going to be back for the playoffs. Well, naturally, because of the defense. 
everyone's saying, well, it's the 16 points that he gets you a game. Well, it's also the defense and the fact that he's one of the best steal people that we have in the league, and it also will increase your fast break with LeBron James and Hughes out in the open floor. By the way, the NBA record for best field goal percentage of the game is 70%. That was way back in 83. Spurs did it against Dallas. Not that I'm getting ahead of myself here. But it is, it's incredible how easy. <laughs> that was, it didn't look so easy, but LeBron James able to put it in and draw the foul. There's Parker running the floor. And they finally miss one. James gathers himself. Great the three. And Damon Jones puts it. He really sees the floor so yeah, well. Okay. And remember now, Mike, he, he had difficulty getting a handle on that ball. He runs the ball down, and he still has the presence. When he, as soon as he got it, he looks up, and great peripheral vision. He picks up Jones in the deep left corner. Ball deflected. Ogaskis then with the block. Signs of defense from the Cavs. Yep. Here we go. People want to get in this game. LeBron James. Oh, tough drive. Slicing between two Lakers. Bobby Brown, again, he was the first overall pick right out of high school back in 2001. Played his first four years with the Wizards, but they were tired of him. And they traded him to L.A. for Karan Butler and Chucky Atkins. He did not live up to expe uh, expectations. Had some problems with teammates. Had to be suspended last year. Him and Gilbert Arenas weren't seeing eye to eye. Well, he's getting a fresh start in L.A. and trying to make the most of it as Brian hits another tough shot. See, that's so frustrating. But you have to realize that Eric Snow is giving Kobe three to four inches. James and Bryant going at it pretty good there. Good help defense from Kwame Brown and Bryant with the steal. Well, right there, Kwame Brown got away with a bang on LeBron James. And Parker fouled and makes the basket. But Bryant played James very physically but look at James not even he's not arguing at all no he's not saying anything but just watch now as he makes his move to the baseline watch to the left you're going to see Kwame Brown come in here all right right there okay now you can see he flops back but there was contact which forced him right back into Bryant Bryant another tough shot <laughs> nails another Kobe Bryant eight for 11 from the field. He's got 19. LeBron happy that he re-signs the Drummond. So Gaskins is having some game. Murray, great move, but Bryant throws it right back at him. Well, Gaskins playing very well, keeping the Cavs in the game. And George unable to hit. You can see just Rusty out there. James hard drive and a foul. LeBron James and Ogaskis have 33 of the Cavs' 46 points. Oh, boy. Puts boy, it in again. Boy, is this young man doing it. He's 9 for 13 from the floor, but the majority of the point, uh, baskets have all been outside of 15 feet. He's had some big games here in this building. Scored 47 back in 2001 when it was the Gund Arena. Same building as James able to put it in. He's got 18 points, 4 rebounds, 4 assists. Comes off the screen. Fires away the three. It's good. Kobe oh. Bryant at the buzzer. Falling away with a hand in his face. Bryant wants the ball. Shot clock down to three. Quick turnaround. That's a two. Not that time. And James with his fifth rebound. LeBron James pulls up. Puts it in. 21 for LeBron James. Good. Fires in. Oh, Good. flips it in. A little English. And the Cavaliers have climbed back from 18 down within four. Just past the midway point here in the third. And Lakers look like they were dominating this game. Nice. And James goes in strong. No help defense there. I like the fact that he didn't settle for the jump shot. Big thing right now, Kobe's struggling. He's 0 for 4 in the quarter. Uh, but the rest of the guys have got to pick this up. Plus, you see, right now, Eric Snow got away with holding him. And, you know, that could have... <laughs> oh. How about that? Yes, indeed. Bryant again, snow all over. Oh, Bryant pretty. gets passed and backs it in. He looks, he wanted a foul. Oh, absolutely. I mean, he got hit. You could hear it over here. Cavs have never led in this game. They've trailed by as many as 18 after a flat first half. James, a lot of outside shots now that they're settling for. Well, once they got it to five, Mike, they, you know, everything has slowed down. Bryant again. Looks like there was a lot of contact. This time puts it in. James. And Bryant both slowed down a little bit in the second half. Defense is really geared to try and stop him. And LeBron James draws the foul. He'll get to the line for the ninth and tenth time this afternoon. Bryant, another tough shot. Oh, Kobe Bryant. Oh, yeah, oh. 
the degree of difficulty in a yeah. number of these jumpers. Murray gets some space. Oh, and knocks down a three. Big shot from Murray. But Murray did hit a game winning three. In one of his first games with the team, ball poked away. See, that's Walton. See, Walton with the hands, the active hands. Good inside. And back to a six point game. Well, Drew has had very few attempts. You know, he's been kind of like lost in a shuffle. He's four for seven in the ball game. But he can do it in this game because of his quickness. Great hands. Walton forced it. Great yeah. hands. Flip Murray got a piece. There you go. Murray inside. Left hand. Oh, pretty adjustment. And it's a four point game. Now that was outstanding. Flip Murray on the drive. Again, Murray. One point game. James on the drive. Inside. Ogowskis. Whoa. Can't go with the second tip. And the Cavs have their first lead of the game. That's their offensive rebounding. Lakers, by the way, they've played in six games decided by just a point. They've had a lot of close games this year. James for three. Bang! Oh, wow. LeBron James wow. from downtown. Wow. Wow. That's his third make in this ball game. That's a clear out. Bryant puts it in. Tie game. So much. So much for four for 15, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Damon Jones back to Murray. Murray inside. He's tripped up and fouled. With 3.4 left, Flip Murray will shoot two free throws. Cavs, Murray. Knocks it down. Cavs by one. Timeout, Lakers. Lakers down by one. Bryant has it. Snow crowds him. Bryant for the win. No good. Oh. And the Cavs with a huge come from behind win.